Welcome back to Hannity. All right, the all left propaganda destroyed Trump media and the Democrats. They're now smearing the commander in chief while flat out refusing to ask President Barack Obama very critical questions about wiretapping. And that is tonight's mini monologue. All right, so the left is breathlessly saying that the president isn't telling the truth over wiretapping allegations. Now, just take a look at some of the headlines from the New York Times, CNN, the Washington Post, smearing the president. Trump offering no evidence says Obama tapped his phones. Trump's baseless wiretap claim. And Trump citing no evidence accuses Obama of Nixon Watergate plot to wiretap, wiretap Trump Tower. Now, the hypocrisy is stunning. Why? The New York Times is accusing the president of lying but they are the ones that printed this headline on the front page of their paper of all days, January 20th. Wiretap data used in inquiry of Trump aides. Now, if you read the article, it says in part, quote, the FBI is leading the investigations aided by the National Security Agency, the CIA, and the Treasury Department's Financial Crimes Unit. Now, the investigators have accelerated their efforts in recent weeks, but have found no conclusive evidence of wrongdoing, the official said. One official said intelligence reports based on some of the wiretapped communications had been provided to the White House. So the New York Times reported on wiretap communications that got to the White House. But somehow, President Trump, he's the one who's lying. This is ridiculous, and it proves exactly why you, the American people, do not trust the media. Now, there's also the ridiculous statement from President Barack Obama's spokesman. A cardinal rule of the Obama administration was that no White House official ever interfered with any independent investigation led by the Department of Justice. As part of that practice, neither President Obama nor any White House official ever ordered, keyword, ordered surveillance on any U.S. citizen. Any suggestion otherwise is simply false. Now, the statement never said that President Obama didn't know about it, like the New York Times told us, just that he didn't order it. So is anyone in the press ever going to ask if Obama knew about the surveillance of an opposition party during an election year? Or will they just give him another pass?